welcome to another episode of How to Be a Nurse at Torrance Memorial. In this episode, we are going to address one of the biggest harms that can happen to a patient during their stay here at the hospital, fall. What evidence-based practices are we doing now so that we can prevent our patients from falling? Let's find out. Over the years, fall prevention risk assessment tools have been developed. Here at Torrance Memorial, we use the Morse Fall Risk Scale. If the patient has a history of falling, has a diagnosis that is likely for the patient to be in danger of falling, uses a cane or a walker, has tubing sucked up to them like IVs or tube feedings, has an impaired gait, is confused, have medications that can cause dizziness or confusion, we automatically use fall prevention strategies because of years of research has shown that these factors along with the environment can cause a patient to fall. We also use color coding for all our patients that are fall risks and the color is yellow. The sign at the door, yellow. The socks, yellow. The bracelet, yellow. Yellow, my favorite color. We also want to make sure the environment is safe, not just for patients, but for everyone. We make sure that there is adequate lighting. We neatly put away tubings and wipes. Also, we make sure that the patient has their belongings and sensory aids close by while they are in bed. The urinal, the glasses, even tissues because trying to reach for something far could cause them to fall. Ah, nurse, ah, I need some tissue. <laughs> and this is why we don't leave our patients without their call buttons within reach. Accompanying patients while they're on their walk is very important, especially when they tend to feel weak. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Always instruct the patients to call for help. It is highly important to answer call lights properly because the patient may want to go to the bathroom. May I help you? Okay, let me have somebody go there and check on you, okay? All right, thank you. And if they do without letting us know, we can always depend on our green bed and bed alarm to let us know. Let us keep our patients safe from harm and apply these best practices to help prevent our patients from falling. Thank you for watching and see you again in another episode of How to Be a Nurse at Torrance Memorial.